Hey there, everybody. So for today, we're going to be doing the EXOMA fight. This fight has a multitude of different ways to clear it. Essentially, I'm going to kind of use a little bit of a joke team to some extent. Uh, but, yeah. Let's go ahead and get this started. So I will say this on this fight, there is some RNG involved. Your your tank can get get locked up. Your tank can essentially just get crapped on pretty hard in this fight, locked up, and it's game over at that point. But the main goal here is to get your Hell Gladiator or your King Bubble, depending on what you want to use. To poison Zoma and take him out that way. Because the poison venomate will do like 1600, it'll just wreck him, he'll game over. Okay, let's see from here, keep formation. Alright, let's go over here. Bam. Okay. Two shot him. Come on. Let's go move up some more. Just gonna side cannon us. It's okay. That is all right. From up here. Ouch. It's all right. Take him out. So let's hit him from here. Let's keep Garamus back. It's one down. Good night. Selflessness up. And we're in position. All right. Here we go. To get Baramos up there, but that's totally fine. Okay, head. Oh, shit! That is not good. It's not good at all. That is bad. It's been poisoned. That part's done. But there's not really much here. Oh, it's gonna take a little, little bit of luck. Oof. Hmm. Still frozen. Oh, great. Now he's, he's back in the fight. Great, great, great. Fucking magical. Looks like get close enough to hit him. Oh, let's leave him right here. I can't get to him. Okay. You get on fear? Cool. Alright, well. Let's see how long we can stall out. This is going to be dicey as fuck. Of course, now he heals. Ouch. 
Okay. He's good. He's healing up. Great. Okay, he's been poisoned. Thunder Slash. Poor Baramos, he's seen better days. Okay, we just have to hold this, hold the line. Come on. Let me get this on the first try. As you can see here, a lot of things can go wrong. I mean, him just... Oh, so even by him doing that ability there, that removes removes the selflessness. So now I've got to be extra careful in terms of not getting messed up by that from these guys here. Because there is no cover, but we may be able to stay at least one more turn. Okay, come on. Yes, Baramil's hanging in there like a champ. Well, let's finish him up with the wave. Take the wave, baby. Bam! Okay. Now we will just poison this fucker to death. And we may be able to, to win this here and get a clear even with this little setup. Oof. It's okay. It's alright. Let's go up there and mince him. Game, set, and match. We're just going to let him hide here like a little girl. Baramos way. Cool. And that is going to look like to be in the fight here. Now, you can do this with one less unit. I mean, you could easily subtract World Reptile and keep in and Baramos. Or you can subtract him for another unit like Lucifer or something to that nature. So there is a lot of flexibility here. This fight is actually one of the easier ones because, I mean, everything here just went wrong for the most part, and we were still able to pull it, pull it out of our asses and win. Now, mind you, some of my units are pretty super powered, but I mean, there's there's things you could do here to to secure that victory. So, if you have any questions in the comments or you want to see some other combinations done, feel free to let me know. And we'll we'll give it a go. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Take care.